All right, before we get stuck into the exercise today, a little bit of housekeeping on the next complete rehab programming course, the CRP2 lumbar spine is happening in three weeks time. And we've got, how many have we got left? Four spots. Four spots left. So you've only got four chances to get on this course. You've got three weeks until the course starts. So if you need to register, head to the website and you can get all the details there. And what I'm gonna show you today is part of what we do in the course to show you how to progress an exercise using bands and get there from, say, a hip hinge, which is what we're doing today, through to a deadlift. This so band load is for your glutes. It's really gonna help her contract as she comes up. Don't want any weight through this, just a pole. Then they feel, feel like they're doing a deadlift. So, drop down into your deadlift, which is gonna be a hip hinge, and she'll, you'll probably find they just get their form a little bit better, and then they can focus on the strengthening work through that hip extension, through those glutes to get that, you feel that now, right? <laughs> correct herself and get her back into neutral. If she was flexing too much like that, she can correct herself there, but still have a bit of load on. So she's doing isometric work here, and she can play around with getting this technique really good here and then also she can be guided by if you come up again she's going to stretch the band if she stretches the band she uses her hips correctly so, so you're putting that band under your feet and using that as resistance and trying to think of it using it as a oh did you see that <laughs> <laughs> that's how you use a band the loads off a little bit more she can adjust flex extend help her keep into neutral at that point, learn to keep that neutral, stiffen, and then go through here, come up again, and push that forward, and there's your deadlift. Mm -hmm.